big outrage, our favorite big bully, Rosie O'Donnell, keeps pushing for an investigation into the 9-11 attacks based on her over-the-top 9-11 conspiracy theories. She says things like, fire can't melt steel, and that should prove the U.S. government brought down World Trade Building Number 7 with explosive. She directly accuses President Bush and the administration of attacking, of attacking the U.S. on 9-11. Listen to this stuff straight from the horse's mouth. I do believe that it is the first time in history that fire has ever melted steel. I do believe that it defies physics for the World Trade Center Tower 7, Building mm -hmm. 7, which collapsed in on itself. It is impossible for a building to fall the way it fell without explosives being involved. World Trade Center 7. She uses her ABC, ABC show The View as a platform to push these 9-11 theories. ABC and Disney are basically allowing her to spew left-wing anti-American propaganda. When will ABC take his stand against this? With me now, Ethan Zahor, founder of StopRosie.com. He's spearheading a new online petition to get Rosie off the air. And also, National Review online columnist Stephen Spruill. So Stephen, uh, you first. The, the, uh, the, all this stuff from, from Rosie comes from this 9-11 truth movement, which she appears to have, have uh, bought into entirely. Does that explain all the venom for Bush and the Bush administration? Well, I think it might be the other way around. Uh, in fact, I think that if you're a pacifist, then it's hard to reconcile the fact that we were attacked on 9-11 by people who hate us and want to kill us. And so the mind, I think, in that instance seeks for alternative explanations. And if you already hate Bush and think he's the source of everything evil in the world, then he becomes sort of a very convenient, natural culprit to pen the attacks on. Stephen, um, StopRosie.com, you, you're doing an online petition. Yes. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, Ethan. Yes. Um, you're doing an online petition. Uh, who's signing it and how many? A lot of people, before I came on, we had about a thousand counts. The site just went online this morning. Um, it's getting hits. Only this morning? Just this morning, yes. Why did, you, why did you start this, and why did you start it this morning? I started, well, I started this weekend. It took me about a day to design. It went online. It got out. The word got out somehow. Something must have inspired you on Friday. What was it? On Friday, I hear, actually, all the time I hear all these anti rosy comments she makes with the... Uh, the fire melting steel and everything else so I said I want to participate I want to do whatever I can to give somebody an outlet to to let their voice be heard on it for the records fire does melt sp steel yes okay <laughs> yes it does <laughs> okay uh, Stephen uh, ABC uh, are they essentially endorsing Rosie's views by letting her stay on the v on the view and continue to spout this stuff every day well, I think, I think that somebody at ABC has a very sick sense of humor in letting uh, this, this clearly unwell person go on TV and continue to say these things which ha are just doing incredible damage to her reputation. Uh, I think as, as long as ABC continues to get ratings from it, they'll, they'll keep her on. But I do think it's irresponsible because we already have polls that show that uh, a growing number of Americans are buying into these conspiracy theories and, it, you know, to, to pretend like the jury's still out on 9-11 is just, it's offensive. Ethan, uh, the, uh, I can't help but think that, uh, that ABC in a way is endorsing these views. They're essentially saying, look, we're going to put you on the air, we're going to put you on every day, we know you're going to say this every single day. It's not like you're just going to go be a guest on somebody's show. It would, would the people signing your petition, the people who actually go to your website, who are objecting to Rosie, would, they be, would it be fair for them to say, look, as far as I'm concerned, these are ABC's views and Disney's views as well. And now, in addition to being mad at Rosie, I'll be mad at them. I think by leaving her on, you are endorsing what she has to say. But what the website does is it calls upon the people to stop watching the show. Where if you take away the viewers, ABC's going to have no choice but to find other... other yeah, but you've got a thousand program. signatories to the petition. Not much yet. Yeah, well, you're going to need more than that to make I a dent in the show. It's, it's still young. Uh, Ethan Zahor and Stephen Spruill, thanks to both of you. Appreciate it. We'll keep an eye on Rosie as, all, as always. Coming up.